Hey guys, so it is the first bath I am able to give of the entire year. And I have Gator here just to show you my bath routine. Um, she closed her eyes. So right here, I have the squeaky clean shampoo and I am pouring some of it into this pink bucket, which I will later fill with water. And right now I'm waving. And so once I fill that with water, I can then put my sponge in the bucket and then start washing him. But right now I am spraying him because it works better when the horse is already wet. the same way. I'm not going to film it because it's literally the same process. And plus I don't feel like doing my turn to that side of them. And so once I'm done that, I'll come back and show you how to do the tail. So now it's time to do the mane and tail. Oh, tail, not the mane. Um, and well, right here, I have the leftover soap that was in this pink bucket. So what I do, I just get rid of that sponge. Take his tail, put it in the bucket. Right now I have the conditioner, I'm just putting that in his tail and then I run a brush through his tail with the conditioner still in it because that just makes everything easily brushed. Now here I have Horse Your Secret, which is a horse moisturizer, and this will help keep this hooves nice and hard and uncracked, and I just put it on every time after I bathe them because their hooves tend to dry out fast for some reason, and it just helps the quality of their feet when I, right after I put this on. And plus Gator has cracked feet, so this is always a daily thing. Next, 
I am Tristan and I am brushing out Gator's mane. It always makes me really happy when I do. And lastly, I apply horse moisturizer and that just helps with the coat and it's not too shiny without getting that slippage. 